Hi, welcome to the Commercial Gas Engineer channel. Just wiring up a boiler um, to commission it. And in the process, I've had a few foot codes. Why did I have the foot codes? Um, first one was blocking because the pressurization unit over here was, was not satisfied. So got a blocking signal. And the other foot, what, did it, what was the other foot I got? Do I have it in here? So I'm on the gas, I'm on, got one foot at the moment. So this foot code came up second so the first thought was to do the pressurization unit was a genuine one then this one was flow temperature sensor is either removed or measures a temperature below range so i managed to gain the settings in, when sort of like went in as an installer and managed to clear that next one that came up was this one now this is the one i'm trying to clear i need instructions to clear this one gas pressure switch so this one come up even though that i've got good gas pressure and so on um, i've purged the air out there wasn't much to purge because the pipe was isolated nearby um, to the boiler um, it's still giving me the problem gauge on and so anyways this is the fault on this boiler um, is it on there at the moment I don't think the faults come up but um, you can see the police lights flashing so this is how I have it wired up so I've got my blocking wires in my BL I've got my naught to 10 volts my signal wires and then i have over here my common and normally open so i'm just going to go through the installer mode in a moment in order to fix this um yeah so it's a gas 2108 i think these are about 17 grand or so um let me know if you've installed any of them or if you've worked on many of them what else can I share with you in this plant room? Uh, hmm. Not sure. Got a little baby expansion vessel there. A pressurization unit. A, what is that over there? That looks like a dirt separator. Okay, and then above, that might be the, is that the um, vent? Sometimes I think I see these combined air and dirt separator. So maybe up there. Not sure what that is. You can take a guess in the comments if you like. Uh, I've got some wheelow pumps in here. What else have we got? Okay, that down there is a some dosing pot, nice and silver. Uh, expansion vessel. Uh, what have they cut on hair? These are interesting. I don't see much of it. You know, you go into plant rooms and you'll just see something that you've never seen before. You think you've seen loads of things and over the years, but then you get one of these cut in. So to, instead of draining it down, they've just cut one of these. But they must, it must cost a fortune to put that in. There's an isolation valve up there. Maybe it was letting by, but they decided to cut one of these drain offs in to use them. I don't know what make it is. I don't know what kind of make it is. Uh, what we go inside this panel? Let's have a look in this panel. Let's look in the BMS section. Is it opening? Okay. So we've got a transformer there. So it's got um, 230 volts. It looks like a step down transformer. And um, then you probably got something 0 to 10. It's saying plus five minus five there and then you've got your ddc controller here and then your inputs and outputs okay what else for pc use only okay i needed a charger earlier i don't i don't even know if that's going to be able to handle my my phone but i did need a charger earlier inside here should we look what's in here um no, I'm not going to bother. I'm not going to turn the power off. My system's happy. And so I just need to get the go through the settings in a moment on this. Uh, have I missed anything in this plant room that you've not seen before? Um, probably not. Uh, okay. All right. Thank you for joining me. Until next time. Bye-bye-bye.